Hello everybody and welcome back to Level Up with Weston, where today we will be reacting to the newest Garden of Bam Bam trailer that released yesterday. Now I didn't know about this up until like maybe an hour or so ago, but we are going to be blind reacting to it in 3, 2, 1, boom. Okay, so it looks like we have a zombie Opila or something. Uh, we got Slow Celine hiding in a corner. Oh, we're following Sheriff Toadster. Oh, Jumbo Josh. What's he doing? He has his arms and pipes. Okay, wait. This is a lot to take in. System operable. We got barrels of Javanium over there. And we've got what seems to be a uh, pink key card. Um, so I'm assuming we're gonna find that somewhere, obviously. Alright, and um, pause. Alright, we got Stinger Flynn sleeping and his arms are in tubes as well. Oh! Maybe they're being, like, contained like they're in a prison or something. That's cool. Okay, we got the drone and we got baby Opla who's followed following us. Uh, we've got Oh, there's a normal Opila. Oh wait! Maybe that maybe that zombie Opila was like Um, I think that was uh the blue Opila, right? Maybe maybe it got like messed up or something. Okay, so we've got Sheriff Toaster and, okay, Bambolina is crying or something. Got a new room with apples. Okay, we're on a train? Oh, we've got a timer with, or maybe a clock with Jumbo Josh on it. Ooh, a ticket! Okay, a mushroom! Okay, a mushroom. Oh, that's uh, Queen Bouncelia! That's her symbol! That, that, this, she's gonna be the villain of this chapter, mark my words. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's keep going. Nothing is funny enough. Okay, so it seems like our theory might be right. The Jester's making like comedic plays, but no one's funny enough for him. I think our theory might be correct. And then we've got, all right, what what new character to do? No new characters, huh? Yeah, we don't have any new characters. That's a surprise. Okay, let's keep going. That's it, wait. We got something. Oh, we got Bouncelia. <laughs> oh. Garden of Ban Ban 4. Release date. And no release date. Um, okay. So that was a heck of a lot of stuff to take in, guys. So, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna restart the video and analyze it basically like scene by scene, like Super Horror Bro would do or some crap. All right. All right, so yeah, this is the uh, Tolga bird or whatever. I forget what it's called, but it seems to look like zombie-ish now. This Opala is the one that fell down. It didn't intend, well, it did, but I'm guessing this one was the one that got beat up. And then maybe regular, well, no, regular Opala Bird showed up later. So uh, this Opala is like dead or revived or something. It's like a zombie Opala. And it's like, um, it's the Tolga Bird or whatever the other one was called. Oh, wait, no, it's different. Because it has like, oh, no, maybe that was Ruffled Feathers. I'm not sure. All right, then you've got Slow Celine hiding in a corner of some sort. But behind glass. And then you've got Sheriff Toaster holding- WAIT A SECOND! Sheriff Toaster- So in the teaser, in the second teaser, Sheriff Toaster was looking at all them. He put them in jail! He put them behind the glass! <laughs> I'm figuring things out slowly. Yeah, cause see, Jumbo Josh's hands are like trapped in pipes. Sheriff Toadster did that. He put Jumbo Josh's hand in pipes. They're in prison, guys. We have to save Jumbo Josh. <laughs> All right, so we got a system operable, the pink key card, and Javanium. Nothing really much to see there besides the red lockers and the chairs and crap, which aren't much either way. And then again, we've got Stinger Flynn with his arms in the pipes. So yeah, Sheriff Toadster is arresting everyone for basically just fighting each other and causing havoc and kidnapping children. This is good lore. This is good story building. Thank you, you four fellows, for freaking once you made your story make sense. Okay. And then we've got Baby Opala standing on a button. Let me rewind a little bit. Um, right there. 
So we've got Baby Opala standing on a button for us, and maybe that activates uh, that activates the wall button, which we press with the drum. Then we've got Opala in a holding cell as well, uh, doing their little peeking thing, like, Ooh, hello. <laughs> All right, we've got kind of a vent system here. <clears throat> Then we've got a pink like hallway. Maybe it may be part of Bouncy Elia's castle. Maybe with uh, Baby Opala and Sheriff Toadster following us. Very interesting. We've got Bambolina. Oh wait! The uh, the bowling pins are the mean kids. They're bullying her in the holding cell. Okay, then we've got some sort of like lounge area with an apple tree. Uh, or maybe a play area for the children of the kindergarten. I'm not sure. Uh, we'll analyze that more when we actually get to it in the game, which I'll have to see when the release date is. Then we've got like some sort of train. Then we've got like a clock puzzle with the Jumbo Josh appearing there. I don't know why. And then we've got some sort of like maybe a roller coaster ride. Maybe that train where you have to put a ticket in there. And we've got uh, Mr. Mr. Kebab Man being the the ticket vendor. Then we've got obviously Queen Bouncelia's castle, uh, which uh, it maybe that pink hallway isn't part of her castle because it actually looks like a medieval castle and not like a kindergarten. So we'll see. And we've got the jester, which again may or may not reinforce my theory of he's making like com he's forcing people into comedic plays, but no one's funny enough. And I don't think the Jester's trapped just yet in a holding cell. Maybe he had, because he hasn't had anything to do with anything yet. And Sheriff Toaster seems to be on our side. So maybe he, he's arresting everyone for like trying to kill us or trying to just stop us from doing what we want to do, saving our children. And the Jester hasn't had a role in that yet. So I'm assuming he, the Jester is not in prison yet. And then we've got the showing of all the characters, except for the Jester, which is odd. But it does look like a kind of like, because it, oh wait, it, look at the bricks, it's in the castle somewhere. So that maybe that's where the Jester lives? I'm not sure. And then at the end here, we've got Queen Bouncelia sitting in her throne. And then that's it, Scarton of Ban Ban 4. Okay, so uh, that was a lot to take in all at once. So uh, from what I can piece together so far, it seems like uh, Sheriff Toaster is holding all the other characters except for the Jester and Queen Bouncelia in like a holding cell of some sort in order to just contain them for trying to kill trying to kill you and uh trying to stop you from getting your kids back which he's obviously on your side we've also got baby opala helping us which was kind of obvious but what's odd is it seems like tarta bird is like all ruffled up ba maybe aggressive now uh i'm not sure we'd have to go further into that when we actually see it. So the story I can piece together for now is that Sheriff Toadster has put everyone in holding cells and we're trying to reach Queen Bouncelia, who might be another good guy. Not sure. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for 500 subs- All right, sorry guys, it cut out again. But regardless, Thank you guys so much for watching and getting me to 500 subscribers. It is an honor to be, just have any attention on this platform in the first place. Uh, like and comment if you want to see more analysis videos on game trailers that are coming out soon. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye bye <laughs>